Hello, Taurus. Hmm. We're gonna just flip that around. It's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot, and I'm coming to do your weekly um, general reading in the week of April 25th through May 2nd, 2022. Crazy, it's still snowing. I want to thank every... Oh, I'm closing off with my Tattoo Tarot by uh, Diana Collins. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. All right, more foes. Let's get this show on the road. All right, let's see what's going on with the Taurus. All right. So, meditation. Somebody's not meditating. I do feel like impulsive. All right. Ooh, so we got the lust. Oh, goodness. Uh, so, it looks like somebody may not be thinking about what they're doing. I feel like somebody's just doing something, okay? And it looks like it may have something to do with uh, a relationship outside of a relationship, okay? So, a re committed relationship or marriage. Somebody's thinking about um, doing naughty things to, you know, uh, could be strangers <laughs> outside of their relationship, okay? You know what I'm talking about. If it's you, I shouldn't have to talk that much. If this is you. All right, let's see what this is. All right, so we got the choices card reverse here. So I do feel like somebody's feeling like they got a choice to make, um, but it should not be a choice. Okay, I do feel like whatever somebody relationship is, it's a committed relationship. And I feel like, you know, this is not inside the rules of the relationship. Okay, so I do feel like whatever this is, it shouldn't be on the table. Okay, but I do feel like, definitely impulsive if i get around this person i do feel like the attraction is is heavy okay let's keep going all right what's going on what's going on what's going on what's going on, what's going on? taurus 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 All right, so we got the risk card reverse here. Yes, yeah, so it looks like somebody's scared to take that risk, but they're thinking about it, okay? So this is one of those times where don't get drink, don't be drinking around that person, okay? Don't be left alone with that person because I do feel like I can't help myself. Look at that. That energy is strong, okay? That energy is strong, but I do feel like either one of you or both of you are already in a connection or with somebody else, okay? But I do feel like this connection is strong. So I don't know why this is. Let's keep going. All right. So we got the conclusion card here. So I do. Oh, goodness. This look like for some of you guys, you already didn't cross the line and trying to end it. Yeah. Yeah. You're going to end chapter one, but it's not over. This connection, this heat that, that I'm feeling is just too much. Okay. Wow. It's like making my throat hurt. Um, thinking about not being around this person. Oh, somebody that married the wrong one. Mm -mm, this connection is just like crazy. My arms is like warm and stuff. Like I said, <laughs> like I said, somebody married the wrong person. Mm -mm. And like I said, I felt the energy. Somebody not letting go. I'm not letting this situation go. I'm not letting go. I do feel like, oh, you know, it's it's the song, this old song. It's Kiss and Say Goodbye. He trying to break up with the fear, but it's just like, it's hard. Okay. I didn't, oh, goodness. All right. So it seems like it shouldn't be a choice, but once you cross that line, see, people think they can just go and, like, I'm going to just step out for one time. Next thing you know, 10 years later, you still wrapped up in that game. Okay. Still wrapped up there. Okay. But that stuff hurts when you hold it on for that long. You hold this a uh, sad affair for 10 years and you end up single. And, you know, they still in that relationship. That is crushing. Okay. Um, or they end the relationship and they looking at you, you know, for handouts. And, you know, they you crushed. Okay. It hurts both of y'all. It's like, that's the person I really want to be with, but I didn't build all this stuff with this person over here. Oh, goodness. Like, it's making my eyeballs hurt. You know how your eyes just start jumping? The nerves? 
of course this is gonna happen um this is gonna happen a few times so it looked like whatever this scene is is getting ready to blow up okay it's getting ready to blow up people getting ready to find out because it's been going on too long going on this has been going on way too long okay that song is by the dramatics if y'all want to hear it all right let's keep going all right, yep. So, right at the beginning, of course, it's going to be play, 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 flirt, flirt, flirt. Next thing you know, yes. Yep. So, right now, it's just all fun and games. And then, it's going to be an addictive affair. Okay? Mm-hmm. Like I said, it's going to come out. Um, so, it could be... Could be uh, Pisces energy, but I'm hearing Aries as well, okay? Um, but I do feel like it's going to come out, and that's what it's going to cause all this chaos, okay? So, never come out. But it's crazy because it's not going to end. Everybody going to go crazy, but it's not going to be over, okay? So, whatever this is, I do feel cycles. I feel like it's just going to keep happening and happening, okay? Until, wow. Uh, it's just going to keep happening until both of y'all end up single and be able to be together. Mm-mm-mm. Dang. All right, let's see what's going on with the Taurus. But what sucks is y'all got to be single at the same time. And that's going to be hard because, I mean, how long are you going to stay single? While they still married or in that relationship. I mean, either one of y'all could leave, like, right now, but who's going to? Just do that. Who should do it is not the question. Who's going to do that? Nobody's going to do this. It's just like somebody, just a whole lot of attachments. Um, it's a lot of detaching. You know, somebody probably take good, take a good month off work. Okay. To separate themselves from this relationship. Um, but wow, the happiness is here. It's like the, the the main relationships are business. This is this is happiness. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. Taurus. Taurus Taurus. All right. So we got the Queen of Wands here. Definitely very emotional situation going on here. Okay, somebody's extremely emotional about this person caring somebody. Ugh. It's like it's not like I'm a heartless person. It just happened and I can't stop. Okay, so somebody's emotional about them not being able to stop either. Oh, it was a movie. I don't know if it was in the nineties or early two thousand, but it was like a movie called Unfaithful. I don't know if anybody ever um, watched that. If you have, leave me a comment. Let's let's chat about it. Um, but that's exactly what it feel like is happening here. Somebody just got swept up in this situation and just cannot stop. They can't stop. All right, so we got the tower card here. So it looks like, of course, everything is going to come crumbling down. Okay, but I do feel like it keeps getting rebuilt. Okay, maybe this the final time it's going to come down. Maybe both of y'all, people in y'all main relationships realize that, like, okay, we, we can't keep these people apart. Let's just... Let's just go, okay? All right, so we got the Eight of Wands here, so I do feel like some kind of moving forward is getting ready to happen, some kind of messages um, getting ready to come out. All right, Justice. Yes, yeah, so it looked like somebody... Um, wow. How, I wonder how that's going to happen. Oh, the karma part. So that karma part is when one person leaves the relationship and the other one is still with that person. You know, it hurts on the side where, you know, this person is... When y'all sneaking together and y'all both going to a house um, with people, that's different from y'all sneaking around together and one going home alone, okay? So I do feel like the karma is getting ready to hit here. I do feel like one of the relationships may be getting ready to separate, okay? So it's still going to be an ongoing side situation, okay? This is going on with this tower card here. Um, Libra energy. I am feeling Capricorn energy with that one up there right now with that tower. 
All right. All right. So we got the six of swords here. So I do feel like some kind of moving is getting ready to go on. Okay. That's uh, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini energy. This eight of wands is um, Aries, Leo, Sag energy. Okay. But some kind of moving forward, moving away. Okay. Um, somebody just could be a way you went away from the one you love when you're at home with your husband or wife. Okay. All right, so we got the five of coins reversed here. So I do feel like a lot, definitely a lot of time has been lost here, okay? I'm talking about if you add up all the time in between all these people. So we got five years, we got four people. That's 20 years all together that y'all lost, okay? Because you lost five years of your life, five years of the person, the, the uh, sad piece life, five piece of husband life, and the sad piece wife or husband life, you know? That's five years out of everybody's life altogether. That's 20 years wasted. Um, time you can't get back. Shoot, if you're happy on the side, go go to the side. But, like I said, things are harder than it seems. But if you really want something, you'll do it. Okay? But definitely a lot of time lost in this situation. And I do feel like somebody is planning something. But, you know, if it happens, it happens. Somebody's not in a hurry to do it. All right, let's see what's going on with this justice card. But I do feel like one of the people separating. Okay. All right, so we got the lover's card here. So I do feel like choices, choice to be made. I do feel like somebody definitely in love with the karma, with that sad piece, okay? Um, this lover's card, I believe. Oh, hold on. That's Libra. I believe this is Gemini, if I'm not mistaken. Lovers, I think it's Gemini. Yeah. I'm like 98% sure. We're going to keep going, though. All right. But some kind of a relationship choice is getting ready to be made. I do feel like it, I love both of these people, just a different type. Um, But I do feel like uh, karma is on the way because I do feel like somebody's leaving a situation to be with the person that they love on the side. Um, and because of the first relationship is crumbling down. Uh, but I do feel like the other person is still going to be in a relationship and it's going to be for a while. Okay. Ooh. All right. So we got the queen. We open like we closed. Queen of wands again. Somebody is very emotional about this person at the beginning and somebody is extremely emotional now because they care. But now they got to watch the person that they love be with their husband or wife. Okay. Other than that, that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rise and size. Thanks for watching.